Michelle Dzalik, and I'm a local landscape painter, contemporary painter, and I live in Santa Barbara, California. And I was fortunate today to meet Carl, who is on a bicycle tour, and he noticed my painting. So today we're going to talk a little bit about each one. Um, and I'm 55 years old. I've been painting for painting and drawing for 50 years. You said you've got your paintings in four locations here in town. Yes. Santa Barbara is a, a very big art town. Yes, sir. And for somebody to get one... I didn't know how excited I was to get in here. This has pushed me to paint almost three paintings a week. I have been cranking out. And I took a break today to go swimming, and this is me. French and I'm part Albanian and I grew up in, I went to France many times and of course all the masters who um, I have studied are very, very dear to me and um, I love Paris and I love France and well, shall we see about it? my work. Yeah, shall we, did you do this right here? Yes. It's got your name on it. This was done on the Riviera. The Riviera is named after the French Riviera like it. How about this one here? This is a surrealistic type of a painting. Um, it is Shoreline Park in Santa Barbara. Okay, and this one? This is across from... I know that. I've been there. Yeah, the Biltmore, the Four Seasons Biltmore. I painted this on location about three settings. It was a nice, hot, warm summer day. It really reflects what Santa Barbara is all about. And that one reflects a fire that occurred just before I got to this town. Hazazita. Hazazita fire. Yes, this was quite a dramatic fire. I was on the beach. I painted this in my studio with some photographs, and it was just an amazing fire that did a lot of damage to our town. But we're back in paradise. The fire's over. This fire wiped out 50 houses. Tens of thousands of people were evacuated, and it mostly wiped out the botanical gardens too, which is a real upset. This last painting is Chill Point, Santa Barbara. Okay, and this one here. Now, there are more paintings in this building, but as you can hear with your ears, this place is packed. So we're just going to look at this one as the last one. Yeah, this is called uh, 732 p.m. Uh, yeah, this is the time that I saw this image. It was after a storm. Um, it's a bit contemporary. I painted in my studio. Okay, Michelle, one, la one last thing, if you will. I noticed that there's price tags on these. But about what's the average price on these? The average price is as low as $225 and as high as $1,200, which is the last painting in the back. It's a very large uh, beachscape. So up to $1,200. Up to $1,200, and they're extremely reasonable because I don't have to pay gallery fees. Otherwise, they would be higher in a gallery. But uh, I've sold six paintings in the last month, actually. Six. In the last month, I sold six paintings. In total, I've sold about 15. Well, congratulations. And we're going to title this one Famous Painter in, in Santa Barbara. Very good. Thank you for the opportunity.